I'm Mary E. Turkington. I was born in Girard, Kansas on uh, January 14, 1926, which makes me 92 years young. I was uh, finishing a, a journalism degree at, at KU at the William Allen White School of Journalism and Public Information, and uh, a man from the Kansas Motor Carriers Association, who was manager at that time, came to the department looking for a young journalism graduate to take over the editor's post of the magazine, the only position. And for some reason, uh, the faculty recommended me, and that was my beginning with the Kansas Motor Carriers Association. Started work there August 19th, 1946. And then in 1950, they sent me down to the legislature to represent the industry. And I didn't know very much about the legislature either. I, I love the legislature and I love the process. It's awkward at times and it's difficult at times, but by and large, the people that served in the legislature were some of the finest men and women in Kansas. And I continued to work under different managers at KMCA and finally I decided that the next vacancy when Bob Halliday left that I would a apply for the job and either get that job or uh, go to law school. So in 1968 uh, I applied along with 30 others but at the end of the day they finally said Mary would you like the job and of course I said yes. Uh, there were two members of the executive committee and uh, both of them <laughs> were a little dubious about a woman being the head of the Kansas Motor Carriers Association and they point blank asked me after they'd offered the me the job, do you think you can do this? And my answer was, if we're going to do business in the men's room, no. But if we're going to do business like we've always done business, yes. Those two guys threw their heads back and laughed, and they were very supportive of me all through the years that they remained on the executive committees. So from 68 until 97, I served as the executive director of the association. And then after my retirement, Bill Graves then, <laughs> in April, appointed me to the Kansas Turnpike Authority for my first term, and I was fortunate enough to be renominated by three different governors uh, and served uh, for six, a total of 16 years. We desperately need to have the infrastructure improved. Uh, the infrastructure remains a challenge. Funding has to be found, and we have to do it because this country needs all of the transportation services uh, working together the best that they can. And I would hope that not only Congress, but state legislators, governors, public officials of all kinds are, can work together to find a workable solution. It's imperative that it happen and soon.